we are heading to this street to find a restaurant that we can eat a special kind of fish called blowfish. Yes, we're gonna eat blowfish. So this is the menu of this restaurant, instead of a boiled fish, they call it a buffet fish. So they have two kinds of fish, uh, version of this buffet fish, one is farm raised and one is wild. Wild is more risky and for this one they will have to, uh, the chef would uh, taste the fish before uh, it is uh, you know, presented to us for us to eat uh, in order to avoid uh, whether there's poison or not. So if you have no idea what buffer fish or blue fish is, uh, they are like this and they are poisonous fish. In fact, if you don't uh, treat it well, you will be poisoned and it will lead to death. So it's a very risky fish to try, but in Japan, since uh, most of them are quite uh, they are certified it and they are more, you know, uh, careful. It is good to try this fish in Japan. Otherwise, I would not try it. <laughs> yep. So she is making um, the buffer fish wine, a special kind of wine that is uh, made from dried buffer fish. So to correct it, it's uh, uh, alcohol that was made from dried uh, buffer fish fin. So fish fin. Buffer fish fin. That's alcohol. Very special kind. Of must try. So this is sashimi. Buffer fish sashimi. So this is buffer fish. If it's not proper, probably uh, treated, it will be poisonous, which is lethal and fatal. Now I'm gonna try this buffer fish. I'm still here. Don't worry. I feel fine right now. I don't really feel anything. <laughs> uh, joking. Very nice. Tastes like normal fish. This is the second dish uh, of the buffer fish cuisine. So, so he's gonna do. So according to the waiter, we have to dip this fried buffer fish into the sauce as well as the vegetables into the uh, sauce as well. So what we're doing here for the second dish is we dip this fried buffer fish into the sauce as well as this vegetable into the sauce. Just want to add, this sauce is very interesting. Um, in fact, this set is like around 3,000 uh, yen and it, it blends uh, Asian uh, culture with Western culture in that they combine the two Asian things into the other. So there's more like an Italian style uh, cuisine uh, blended in with uh, more Japanese style cuisine. So now this is the third uh, buffer fish dish. So the chef just now told us to wait for around five minutes while they cook it. Uh, and then we'll, they, he will open it and we can eat from it.
Now it's boiling. Wow. It's almost done, I hope. So this is what it looks like inside under the seafood and buffet. You can eat it straight out of here, this bamboo. So after adding oil, it looks like this, olive oil. So if you drink the soup, it tastes really good. It has, I guess, it's the flavor of butter fish or noro fish. But it tastes really good, and it has olive oil on it. So this set that we order is a whole new menu that mixes Italian style with Japanese style. So they have add some Italian ingredients or style of cooking into it. So, so this is the third dish, and we are going to barbecue it. Like this. It looks like this. They are roasting it, roasting it. They are roasting it. So this needs like a second to get it cooked. And this needs like a minute. More than two or three minutes to get it uh, cooked. Barbecue. Hey. The fourth dish is uh, soup. Uh, rice with soup. Not taste. It smells really good. Um, I think they would have to add um, some oil at the end, but it, now it already smells really good. So rice with soup. Doesn't I'm not sure whether we call it this in English, but there's the rice in the middle and there's soup with it. It looks pretty, it smells pretty, and I hope it tastes pretty. Let me dig into it right now. So at last we end with a dessert and it's ice cream it seemed. <laughs>